Don't Lick the Dog, Making Friends with Dogs by Wendy Waman. For Momo, who loved children and always wanted one of his own. Dogs, dogs everywhere. Whoa, stop down. Slow down, stop right there. May we pet your dogs? You're so polite. You can pet these five, but Maddie might, might bite. Easy now, take it slow, with meeting dogs that you don't know. Don't stick your nose into Stella's face, Stella's face, and tell your friends she needs her space. Stand still and let dogs come to you. Just smell your hand or sniff your nose. But curl your fingers underneath in case one greets you with its teeth. Wap, wap, wap. Dogs hate that. Gently stroke his chin or chest. Or rub his cheek. Boo likes that best. Before you give a treat to Kate, make your hand into a plate. It's all... Lick, lick, lick. Too much is ick. It's all right to say enough. To... S to all that sloppy, kissy stuff. Yip, 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 yip. Cross your arms and turn your back when Jake jumps and barks like that. <sighs> oh no, that spells trouble. When Maddie makes that awful sound and wears that ugly, wrinkled frown, wrinkled frown. Stand up straight and stay very still. If you let her walk away, she will. Dogs aren't toys to hug and squeeze, or poke or chase or tug or tease. Just like you and just like me, dogs have personalities. If they could talk, these dogs would say, We wish all kids behaved this way. Good manners show you care. And when meeting dog, when meeting new dogs everywhere. Do you